That was the most polite. That was the most polite applause we've received all afternoon. That was outrageous. No, I liked it. It was, it was nice and subdued. It's sort of like my mind frame at the moment. Numb. No, no, it's okay. Trust me. After uh, as much whiskey as I have imbibed this weekend, I don't think not my head could take another squeal in the ear like I got the other night. It's another reason for the glasses today, too. I can admit when I'm hungover. I'm finished. Goodbye. Um, what shall we do? Anything Danny, you guys like to hear? Cool. Yeah, play something we know. Um, let's, let's do, uh, should, we, should we speed it up a bit? Monto? Yeah, yeah. Monto? That's not speedy. <laughs> it's so funny that people are digging on Monto because I thought that, you know, all right, this is a song we'll learn really quickly and no one will care about it. And everyone's been requesting it this weekend. It's so weird. Okay, we can do Monto. down in that lady's lap. Which now begs the question, is that a bassist in here laughing and just happy to see us? Queen 
she came to call on us, she wanted to see all of us. Thank God she didn't fall on us, she's 18 stone. Mr. Me Lord Mayor said she is that all you have to show to me. Oh no ma'am, here's some more to see. Go my own. Take me up to Monto, Monto, Monto. Take me up to Monto, Langaroo. We'll all go up to Monto, Monto, Monto. Yes, we'll go to Monto, Langaroo. Good night to you. That wasn't so bad for forgetting the first word. Oh, you're fine. Right. And, you know, I got it in time. That's the whiskey. <laughs> whiskey, whiskey, and say whiskey. Whiskey and pills. Whiskey and pills. Good, good grief. This is like a Q&A session. What's, what's your name? <laughs> That's, why was that funny? Because you should know it's cinnamon. Cinnamon? Yes. Okay. This is cinnamon's request hour, apparently. <laughs> this is fine. I'm not complaining. Hey, we don't have a set list. Somebody oh, no, no, no. No, it's... I'm down for playing whiskey and pills. I'm always down for whiskey and pills. I know, you like it. Just so every, uh, th there's a, a common misconception that the pills that I like to take are not aspirin, but they absolutely are. Whiskey should always be taken with aspirin. Or ibuprofen. Afterwards? Nothing. That was totally just between her and I. Oh no, we're getting in. A little bit darn than we heard it. <laughs> Which makes it really awkward because the last band to play in this room was, oh no, before the ha Heavy Hammer it was Whiskey Dicks. <laughs> oh, Whiskey yeah. Pills? This is a narrow, narrow path we're, we're wandering down now. I'm just going to start it like this. <laughs>
wiped it from my memory. That oh my God. That's not the part of Spaceballs I remember. These are not the bandmates you were looking for. These are not the <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, who wants to hear another song? <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, we can do that. Um, John Stewart. Yeah, get your bassist work out here. Now you know why I'm in a t-shirt. Just because I threatened to, to perform one line down doesn't mean you can. ran out of the gates on that song like a bat out of hell. Dan. 
poor kitty's fingers. I just fingers. had to wake up a little, that's all. My fingers. I'm not awake enough to play that fast. Well, now you are. <laughs> I'm sure that sounded like absolute bollocks. So you give it up for kitty on that one. No, it's not. <laughs> no, we should. You did really well. Kitty Steedle on the fiddle there. Two or for fingers. Two or for fingers hemorrhaged in that, but... Next door, next to these these creatures who are here, that are very loud, and and I love that every time I speak really loud, they 
there's a ring back. There's there's a ring. You hear it? La. Sorry, it's the small things in life. That's <laughs> because I'm. You forgot to say alcohol as you went past. If you were at the beer garden when we played there on Friday night, this woman just out of nowhere Alcohol. walked past. And that was really the moment of the show, except for when I said the word dinghy in front of Kitty and she died. I don't know what that was about. That was so funny. You know, I think it's because I didn't have any tea this morning. I didn't drink any tea or any coffee. Hey, I made some really strong coffee this morning. I just had some. It's amazing. Very, very, very strong. Nemo is tea. She's actually here voluntarily. Yeah, she is here voluntarily. This is scary. Why are you so here?
Don't be dissuaded. It is what it seems. Follow your dreams. Thank you very much. That was a song that was written by a band called God's Favorite Beefcake. Um, out of Seattle, and um, the gentleman who wrote that song is no longer with us, and so it's a, it's, it's a song that we like to perform and remember our friends. And in the vein of remembering our friends and not making this into a macabre and a forlorn show, let's do another song that's happy. Like, um, We the Walia. <laughs> There's nothing like stabbing a baby in the head to make me happy. Alright, this time you gotta help out. So I'm gonna sing a line and then you sing Lila Lila Walia. And I'll sing another line and you sing Down by the River Salia. There's only 12 of you, so you have to sing very, very loud. few of you have drinks. Okay, good. Cheers to you. Thanks for, for being our hardcore audience today, this weekend and showing... And as I say, thanks for being our hardcore audience and showing up someone... Yeah, so hey, book her off. You stayed your 30 minutes. Fine. <laughs> thanks for coming out this weekend. So, how many of you are from Ocean Shores? Five? Or four? Because I can count. How many of you are from out of state? Okay, there we got some Washingtonians. Nice, that's unusual. It's it's rather unusual to have Washingtonians in the audience. Don't make me do that again, Jesus Christ. <laughs> No, 
I think it's awesome. It's like it, it's kind of unusual that we have a room full of nothing but people from Washington. Because even when we play in Seattle, there's always people there from out of town. So I think it's really cool. One. Okay, you're not from Washington. Well, you don't count. You're playing. I was not even. You're not even. Take us all. Play your bass. this festival and I wrote it for this this pub. This bloody festival. This bloody festival. So we'll see how it goes. Yes. 
on her face, her face. song I'm thinking of her face to the stone. They've glued down her face to the stone. I love how you went old school and busted out the candles. <laughs> Who you got a candle? Yeah. Oh on your phone. I was like, who did you really bring a candle in your purse? <laughs> that's that's very prepared. Oh, oh, did you download it? No. I'm honored. I'm honored. You got the Freebird app, right? Oh. It's the Freebird app, in case you're wondering. Freebird. Available on, on iTunes. So are we all having a lovely time? I, I, I kind of wish I had a stool. Just, just saying. We could have story time with Chris. I'm sure that Chris would love that, though. I think Chris gets bored of my stories. If you're just tired today, yeah. I think we all are. Awesome! Oh, you're a good lawyer. Thank you. I thought that we'd be able to hear like Sons of Mal not Sons of Malarkey, but um, they might have just <laughs> packed it up and left. No, no, they're, they're teetotalers. They would have gone for it. We should really kind of just traipse over there and crash their guerrilla guerrilla warfare there. They they play Ten Thousand Miles to Bedlam. That was one of the weirdest and coolest experiences of my life to come into a set, come into a the festival, and hear someone playing a song that I've written. I was a weird, like it made me feel weird, but at the same time it was really, really, really cool. And like, you know, oh cool, I wrote a song that someone wants, someone else wants to play. And not just me. <laughs> well then they have to drag everybody that they've got. And the, that's what I'm thinking, yeah. Yeah, well we can't roll it out. Um, wow, I'm sweaty. Um, we've got 20 minutes. So you, can, you can do it. <laughs> oh, I, I don't want to go next door. That's... Okay. Oh, we haven't done this song plugged in. Yeah, what is it? Not on my door. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Shake it up, shake it up. Shake it up. Shake it up. Shake it up. Walk it off, dude. Walk it off.
was fun. Have you guys had fun on your first festival? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Was it anyone else's first festival? Yeah. Yay! What'd you think? Great. Excellent. I can't believe it's your first festival. No, no, the the, the, the lady who works here, the employees. I, but I thought, did you both raise your hands? Oh, I didn't realize you both raised your hand. I'm sorry, the ladies. <laughs> There's a dog. Um, so what do you think? Is it crazy pants? Can you wait for them up for next year? Or do you need do you need some time off first? <laughs> Did you, do you get to go in the green room in the, in, the, in the apartment and crash out for a little bit? That's not fair. Hey, that's good. Because then you can be like, wait, 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 I'm not sure this is quite... Oh yeah, I agree one. Yeah. You, you should try that one. <laughs> um, I'd like to, for the very last time in this festival, introduce you to everyone on stage since we're being quiet and talkative. Um, to the, the back of the room there is Mr. Dan Lyle, who plays the drums. Yeah. Who thought that he had to, who thought he was going to be able to set the acoustic sets out until we told him he had to play a chair. <laughs> and then um, this is Mr. Daniel McManus on the bass. Mr. Chris Rakelski on the electric guitar. This is my friend Stokely who plays the hurdy gurdy. You have to say it just like that, the hurdy gurdy. You have to think of yourself as the Swedish chef for the Muppets. Hurdy gurdy. And then this is my friend Kitty Steagle who plays the fiddle. And then back there in the black shirt, that's my friend Scott Ferentz, who does all the sound and everything else for the band. So if you wouldn't mind giving him a hand. And of course, um, my name is Chris, and this is Occam's Razor. And this is our very first festival together, but not Occam's Razor's first festival. So it's been a bit weird and awesome. Um, and we're very, very happy to have this as our official debut back into the, the world of Celtic music. And, you have so much not to look forward to from here. <laughs> it's all downhill. Um, but we, it, it, this really has been a blast and it's been a great way to introduce these guys to the, the Celtic community in the Pacific Northwest. And, and no matter what anybody else says in the country, we have the best Celtic community here. We have the best Celtic music. <laughs> Screw Tally Moore and their Wisconsinite weirdness. Kidding, I really like them. Um, you're dying to do Galway races, aren't you? Actually, I'd like to do December. Oh, God, no. We haven't played it once. I know, there's a reason. It's not Celtic. We're doing the request, right? No. I get one. No, fans will get requests. Uh, I'll add a request. What do you think? No. Oh. no. You used to be my favorite. I love you. Thank you. No, no, we just, it, it doesn't sound right. It doesn't sound right yet. It's a hard song for me to sing. What CD is it on? It's on, oh yeah, we can just play the track. Yeah, oh. <laughs> Why did we do that the whole show? Uh, are, are, are you asking for the song that, that, that he wants to play? Yeah, it's on Wolves in the Walls. It's the last song on Wolves in the Walls. And it's just a really difficult song to play Celtic-wise. And... It, that's for that's for more of a rock show and my vocals aren't quite there today, so um Let's do whiskey Jane. Okay. Why don't we do why don't we do gravel walk so we can rest? That would be pretty beautiful. And then we'll do whiskey jane. Okay. That's my right into December. Well you know. I've been singing that song. Kitty
Shake huh? it that way. Where do you think we're shaking out, Chris? I don't know. I just see you going like this. No, we're going like this. It's a new dance craze. Oh, it's, it's called the one-armed chicken. <laughs> and the minute you just, and the minute you just, you just, you just, you just alcohol. <laughs> She, it's time she earned her. her. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like it when the waiters come. I like that. That sounds more right there. All right, Mr. Dan, would you like to start us off?
dark and black because the slaves are sad and broken hearted to lose your father dear they kiss me darn it but they're trying to play to be with me and dear so smother now to read the corner of the fever I was born cut yourself the thorn to find his cross and cover the brand and pair of crows are rattling over the cross and fright and all the dust on the rock and road to double and one to three for five and the hair turn her down the rocky road all the way to double the one and then be done Thank you very, very much. We've been a lovely audience. We're gonna go pass out now. Oh, yay. Did I say that? Yay. Hey, you made one. Hey, I did. Awesome, man. Fortunately, I had to work. Yeah. Hopefully, get some money this weekend. Yeah, right back up today. Hopefully, you made more. You guys worked harder. <laughs> <laughs>
What the hell? Next time. Turn it off. Thank you, sir. Yeah, we'll see you soon. We'll be back. Thank you, sir. Next time. All right. Yeah, man. All right. Absolutely.